Hey guys, and welcome to Let's Play Guacamelee. I'm Nye, and uh, we're going to be starting up here. This is take two of this run. It's the first time the game froze. I'm hoping that doesn't happen again. Uh, we are going to go ahead and start a new game. Last game was, again, just froze up uh, in the middle of gameplay. Looking forward to this. Made by the same guys who did uh, uh, Mutant Blob's Attack. Juan! Are you home, Juan? Juan, wake up, Juan. I'm assuming our guy's name is Juan. Okay, so uh, let's go. Uh, we're gonna go upstairs. Guy looks like he's a bit of a boxer. Lots of alcohol. Got a bit of a Mexican theme going on here. <laughs> Lots of tequila. There you go, Mexican. You're finally awake. Noon is upon us. The sun's at its zenith. That's typically what noon means. No time to sleep the day away. The Dia de los Muertos festival is nigh. Uh, that would be my name for one. And uh, also, uh, for Miracle, that's Day of the Dead. Take some time to compose yourself. I could use your strong arms at the church once you brush your teeth. I've already checked the house. There's nothing in there to brush your teeth, so it's not an option. So let's go ahead and move. Objective, go to the church in Pueblocho, uh, Lucho to help uh, something, something, something. It moved too fast before I could read it. But go to the go to the church. We can hit uh, back to uh, figure out where it is, all the way to the left. So this is the agave field. This must be agave. I thought they were aloe last time I went through here. Uh, there is no, like, walk. You just move fast no matter what, apparently. Um, but uh, these Avagave are very, very regular in their in their placement, aren't they? Like he is, this man is the ultimate farmer. If this is his fields, because look at that, they're all evenly spaced, gridded out. They all look exactly alike. That's amazing. I do like the Celsius graphics. And uh, here are Adobe buildings. Here's the, we're off to the Pueblo Show. I used to uh, used to go down to Santa Fe all the time, so I uh, got used to the sight of Adobe. Cool, we can break stuff. Uh. Let me go to the left here. Ooh, it's a person. Juan, I have a fiesta soon. I don't want to be short of tequila. Well, I have plenty, apparently. Oh, sorry, Juan. I'd love to invite you, but it's luchadors only. Oh, you dick. Oh, well, see if I invite you to my next party. Yeah. What do you have to say? Polo Rojo. Don't beat chicken. Try it. Okay. Hola, Juan. You remember my son, the luchador? He caught three bandits trying to steal holy water from Freya Yeye. That is hard to say. Okay, well, good for him. Uh, let's go in here. Ooh, there's a toy down there. Can I reach that somehow? Ooh, oh, oh, this swing. Oh, that's cool. You can bump into this. It certainly is quiet in the house these days. I just can't bring myself to get rid of her favorite toy, though. So I keep it in the cellar under the stairs. I can't reach that. Let's, uh, let's go this way. The devil statue. That man is manly. Look at those manly pecs and that manly belt and that manly mask. Hi, person. It's true. I was a real mamacita in the old days. You better believe it. Uh, my uh, sister's boyfriend is uh, from Puerto Rico, and my sister is uh, majoring in uh, Spanish. So, uh, or was earlier. So I hear these words around the house all the time now. Gato Negocio versus Rama Soltero. I, I have no idea if I pronounced that correctly. I'm going to try my best. But uh, let's see. El Presidente's daughter is not just beautiful. She's also muy inteligente. Didn't you know she has a degree in <laughs> humanities? Ah, <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. What do we got in here? Anything? Ooh, it's a chest. What's in here? Do, do I punch it? Money. Wow, a lot of money. Can I, can I go? Is that a place I can go? No? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to try to pronounce things. I don't think I'm going to be able to... Yeah, that that poster. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to be able to pronounce everything correctly, but I'm going to try. Uh, Frey Ayeye says that I'm the best mathlete in town. Can you ditch it? <laughs> oh, God. The, the puns. The puns. What do you have to say? I remember you and El Presidente's daughter would hang out all the time. You haven't spoken in years. Why? Because I'm a drunk idiot, apparently. Is this the... Uh... Okay, this is where I'm going, apparently. Inside we go. They, seriously, there are stained glass windows of little doors. Hola, Juan. Thank you for coming to help. I'm trying to clear out some space in here. We're expecting people to come from all over for the festival. Even El Presidente's daughter has returned from La Universidad de Santa Lucita. Enough gossip. Could you bust up those empty wine barrels over in the corner? Can I drink them first? Okay, they're broken. Have, oh, and there's another one. Happy? I broke them for you. Now you can clean them up. What strength! I knew you had it in you. 
El Presidente's daughter always said she saw your potential as well. Such a nice girl, and I'm so glad that El Ambassador's son is out of the picture. I love, I love the names. Him and El Cabinet Minister's wife. Seriously, do these people not have names? What a scandal. Hey, look, it's a person. Ablanda del Rey del Roma. Look who appears. Is that what that means? Hola. Oh, hello, Frey. I won. Look at the smile on her face. She just lights up. Frey asked me to stop by today. I didn't expect to see you here. Uh, you to be here. Juan, you look so, uh... Remember when we were kids? I love how she just goes off of that. We used to get into so much trouble together. Wow, that feels like so long ago now. You've really grown up. Well, thank you. I know the five o'clock shadow is not a... Look at the grin on his face. That's kind of creepy. Anyway, Frey, I found those chairs you're asking about. I'll bring them over later. Juan, could you come by the mansion and help me carry them? I'd really love to spend some time with you. Dude. Like, dude. If you want... Maybe we can even go to the vessel together. Dude, you, you say yes. Talk. Don't just stand there slumping. I should go. Hope to see you later, Juan. Bye, Frey. Dude, you're not gonna... Hey, Juan, what, didn't you hear what she said? That was your chance. Oh, this is better than watching my te uh, telenovelas. Seriously, dude, you're a dumbass. Whoa, how many times have I tell those kids not to play with fireworks? Something tells me those weren't fireworks. What was I saying? Yes! El Presidente's daughter. You should really go see her. Go to the mansion and talk to the daughter. Okay, I can do that. Uh, that's to the left, apparently. I thought it was uh, to the right, actually. Uh, did you guys break this door? Was that broken already? Okay, these guys don't seem to be bothered. This old casa has been abandoned for years. People you say that a witch used to live here. True or not, no one wants to live in this house. The Amazing Tequila Brothers! El Presidente's Mansion. I'm glad we have a sign for this. Hey, Juan, what's up? Some chairs for the festival? Sure, I'll just... Explosion. Ay, Dios mio! El Presidente's Mansion is on fire! Do something, Juan! The only reason I know how to pronounce that one on the top, if I even did, is because it was in uh, Red vs. Blue. With, uh, uh, Lopez. There, for some reason, everything's on fire. Run, one! Run! Save her! That's a lot of fire. This is a huge mansion, Jesus! Uh-oh. Oh, so someone at- The hell did you come from? Dude, this guy looks all sorts of evil. You know this has to be the, like, the big bad right here. Oh, so someone is trying to play hero. You're far from the fields, Agave boy. This is no place for you. One, run now before this ugly skeleton gets you too. God, she's the hero. Oh. What is with Firehead Man with the guns? Haha, what do we have here? I sure wouldn't mind melting those eyes off your skull. Wow, this is, this is certainly kid-friendly. Gran Kalaka, it would be my pleasure to get rid of this intruder. Are you just gonna melt my face? Leave this one to me, Flame Face. That's a real original name. I could use a bit of action today. Oh ho ho. I love how her hair is just like flowing there. Silencio! If Jaguar y Javier was here, he could be trusted to handle this. Unfortunately, he is occupied. I'll get rid of this puny Jimador myself. Okay, so the girl with the flowing hair is unable to handle this layabout, and the guy with the guns is not worthy, so the head honcho is gonna kill me. The living world may have chosen to forget me once, but I won't give them a choice this time. Yeah, this is a, uh, I'm Carlos Calaca, ruler of the dead world. And you, you're not even a luchador. No, dude, I'm just a passerby, leave me the hell alone. Prepare to die. <laughs> oh. Special guest presidente's daughter. Am I gonna be able to? No. <laughs> there was not even an option for me to do anything. Juan, <laughs> no! I didn't even have an option. Oh, apparently I just uh, achieved unlocked. Why all the long faces? I didn't even have an option. To Guys, there was no. I could not fight back. There was no option for me to do anything. Why is everything purple? Okay. Let's go, uh, let's go this way. Uh, this looks an awful lot like the mansion I was just in. Am, am I not supposed to be dead? I, re I recall that I'm supposed to be dead. Pueblucho. Okay. Um, it's, it's flooded, apparently. Well, this is a house. Let's go in. 
There is, uh, there's nothing here. There is Kalaka on the background. There's a lot of skulls. Kalaka for mayor. Okay. That's about it. Uh, what about over here? Boarded up houses. Nothing helpful. Boarded up houses. Nothing helpful. And, uh, cuts. Ooh. Oh, that glows. And if it's glowing, it is somehow important. Ooh, it's a girl in a mask and a slightly ripped, uh, thing. Greetings, one. I am Tostada, guardian of the mask. Isn't that the name of a potato chip? No, not potato chip. A, a, a dipping chip? Nacho chip? How interesting that the mask has revealed itself to you. Kalaka has thrown the universe out of order. You must have some role to play. Oh, it's a RPG. Okay, that's what's going on. If you put this mask on, Juan, its power will bring you back to the world of the living. Are you ready? Do I get a choice? No, I just, apparently I'm just going to grab it and... Oh, it's Go Go Power Rangers time. No, it's, it's Go Go Power Rangers time. <laughs> Transformation sequence, go! My shirt bursts because my muscles suddenly ripple. I am a badass. Viva la resurrección! Psst, Luchador, over here. The town is under attack by evil skeletons. When are skeletons ever good? I mean, if it's in a game, you're typically, it's a, it's a bad thing. They've locked everyone in the church. I fear they intend to burn to the ground. Please, save us. I'll stay here in this barrel. Before you go, though, a tip. If you ever want to check your current objective, hit that arrow. Now, please go save the town. I'll keep pretending to be a barrel. How did I know that was coming? Really? Do you have a second player? I may now join. Oh, uh, well, second player's not going to join. But, uh, okay, guys. Well, that was a, a fun 10 minutes, fun 11 minutes, fun 11 minutes and 54 seconds. I'm going to enjoy this game, I'm sure, because one, I get to make fun of things, and two, the game makes fun of itself. I will see you guys next time when we continue to work on this. Ta-ta.